I'm totally delighted uh, to be able to introduce the Palo Alto Community Child Care Agency as they receive their very well-deserved Tall Tree Award tonight. PAC is a time-honored and well-known Palo Alto Early Childhood Care and Education Agency, which since 1974, in partnership with our city and more recently with our school district, uh, has offered support to working parents and their children in the community. With a long history of striving to provide the very best to these families through an innovative centralized structure that enables the smooth operation of many small, intimate, nurturing, and exciting environments where children can thrive during their time away from their parents. PAC has proven its value over time. While PAC is well known for their outstanding service to the many working families who depend on quality child development centers for their children, it has done so much more for the community of Palo Alto. From its early days, PAC has understood that children's learning and development, physical, cognitive, emotional, and social is critical to the long-term vitality of our community and the PAC professionals providing the care and support to the children of Palo Alto have done their very best to engage in outreach and continuous improvement to make sure that their programs are at the forefront of the early childhood education field. They have always understood the principle that recent research on the development of the human brain has made so clear that children's development uh, in their early years is the foundation for all later learning um, through childhood and beyond. Their programs have prepared the children of our community to take full advantage of all the excellence that Palo Alto schools have to offer and to excel in their academic, physical, social, and emotional development. This partnership between PAC, our city, and the school district has developed over the years to become ever more effective at working together to give all of our community's children of every economic level every chance to launch themselves into their young adulthood ready to meet the considerable challenges that the world has to offer. But that's not the sum total of PAC's contribution to the community. Its resources in support of excellent children's programs have, made, have been made available to other children's programs in the city as well. I know this from personal experience, as you heard, for 29 years. I ran the Children's Preschool Center at Cubberley, and for most of those years, PAC was an enthusiastic and an invaluable partner in numerous projects that enabled not only uh, my center, but many child development agencies outside of PAC to have access to professional development, a great lending library of a children's equipment, a wonderful teacher's resource center and work center uh, for Palo Alto educators. And it has also been a place for smaller centers and family child care homes to come to for advice and support. From its early beginnings, PAC has carried forward an innovative, collaborative tradition in support of Palo Alto's children. All of us who are involved in and who care about the well-being of our community's children have benefited. I am really honored to introduce PAC's executive director, Janice Shaw, who is both a valued friend and a colleague to accept Palo Alto's Tall Tree Award. Thank you, Rachel. It thrills me that you were the one to present our award tonight. Um, it is an honor to accept this award on behalf of the children, families, staff, volunteers, and supporters of PAC. Thank you to the Palo Alto Chamber and to the Palo Alto Weekly for this meaningful recognition of the work that we do. PAC began its work in 1974. We are 40 this year. The planning for early education in Palo Alto began much earlier than that, when in 1969, a group of courageous mothers encouraged the Palo Alto City Council to consider the growing need for quality, affordable childcare in Palo Alto. In 1974, a child care task force was appointed by the City Council to take an active and supportive role in the provision of child care and related services 
and called for a nonprofit to be established to implement the task force recommendations. This is where PAC took its first baby steps. Over our 40-year journey, PAC has provided care for infants, toddlers, preschoolers, and school-aged children. At present, each day, we care for just over 900 children at 19 sites, all in Palo Alto. PAC's mission is to, as a community leader, <clears throat> partner with parents and other agencies to provide quality, professional, and accessible childhood care and education. It's the combined efforts of so many that make this important work possible, so many of whom are in the audience tonight. The City of Palo Alto and the Palo Alto Unified School District partner with and support PAC to allow us to provide services to families who could not otherwise afford high quality programs. PAC's Family Partnership Program serves approximately 150 children each year, allowing these children to learn, grow, and play together every day, thus enabling their parents to work or go to school. The program serves, fa serves families like the Taylor family. A single mom with three, three children, Ms. Taylor spends her days going to school and participating in nursing internships. Her three young children spend their days at PAC preschool and after school programs engaged in learning, playing, and exploring. This care allows Ms. Taylor the comfort to focus on her own learning in an effort to improve her family's life. None of this possible without the support of the city and the school district along with our generous donors. Our professional, dedicated, and passionate staff, many of whom are here tonight, are the heart and soul of PAC. Their commitment to providing quality environments and experiences for the children is second to none. They change over 350 diapers a day. <laughs> they spend 50 hours supporting homework each day. They prepare 200 hot meals every day. Somebody was telling me today how grateful they are for the hot meals. And they give and receive countless hugs every single day. PAC believes that our staff is the greatest asset to our agency's work, and we are committed to supporting their lifelong learning, their personal well wellness, and their professional growth. I truly believe this Tall Tree Award is a reflection of our staff and their commitment to Palo Alto's children. We are grateful to the families who trust us to partner with them in raising their children, who count on us to help with the morning goodbye, sometimes with tears, but mostly with smiles, who deserve to leave their children each day with peace of mind, who in many cases become our friends for life. PAC's thoughtful and dedicated board of directors plays a significant role in the well-being of the agency its staff, and our children and families. While remaining champions for staff, the board ensures that the agency is and remains viably, viable, healthy, and resilient. I'd like to personally thank the PAC board for their unwavering support. And the children. That's really what we are all about, the reason PAC exists. The endless questions, the smiles, the hugs, the tears, the wonder. It is simply about our community's next generation, their growth and development, their nurturing, their love of learning. It's the work of an entire community to raise children, and PAC is proud to be a critical part of our future's success. So many of you here tonight have a PAC story to share. As you share those stories with each other, reflect upon your role in the success of PAC, how warmly our community embraces young children, and how very special our community makes PAC feel about its work. I'm deeply grateful to be part of this amazing organization and honored to share this award with every partner, donor, volunteer, board member, teacher, administrator, family, and child who makes this one big, wonderful, happy PAC family. Happy birthday, PAC.